Hello gamers and welcome back to another video. So I heard that the new attachment was gonna get added to the test place known as the muscle booster. And it has been added to the test place now. Basically what it does is that it increases a gun's RPM by 5% and increases the recoil. So just from that you can re already tell that, the, that this attachment just sucks, alright? So at first I thought it would be useful on semi-automatic guns such as the SCAR SSR, Y2000 Infidious and stuff. But the SVDS RPM only goes from 60 to 63. Bro, insane advantage, you know? And the SSR RPM go, go from 220 to, to like 235. Bro, insane. Yeah, okay. But then I tested out more high fire rate guns such as the Vector. I think it went from 1200 RPM to 1260 or 70 RPM. And at that high or and when you have that high high RPM, you really won't notice it. It will it will be better if you use like a compensator or something just to reduce your recoil. Same with the M231, you will not notice it. But you will notice it on kind of medium fire rate guns like M16 and A3, AUG H bar, M16 and stuff like with with like 600 RPM to 800 RPM. With those guns, you can actually notice the the change in fire rate. But you will also notice the insane recoil in... Uh, what should I call it? The insane recoil... Something. I, I don't remember the word, bro. But yeah, it kinda sucks, okay? The muscle booster sucks. You need 1200 kills for, to unlock it on a gun, which is a lot. Like, the ballistic tracker needs 1500 kills. Uh, the TA11 ACOG needs 2500 kills, I think. But yeah. But yeah, 1200 kills is still a lot of kills. But yeah, it's currently currently in the test place and I'll link the test place down below. But basically, this attachment sucks. But I, uh, like, instead of a 5% increase in fire rate, it should get a 10% or like 15% increase. That way it could get more recoil, which makes it work basically, and more fire rate, which makes it better, so it like evens out. Since a 10% recoil with the removal of a recoil no a 10% fire rate increase with the removal of a uh, recoil damper something recoil controller i don't know what muscle breaking compensate basically and it, more recoil on top of that it just makes it balance you know and yeah but yeah that's that's the muscle booster there's not much to say about it other than it sucks so yeah if you enjoyed the video press the like button. If you really enjoyed the video, press the dislike button. If you hated the video, press the like button. Subscribe, buy my merch even if I don't have any, and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.